So, this is a table, it's nice isn't it? Table and chairs. Very nice, you might say, you know? But there's a story behind it. Come with me. This table just got delivered. But, and this is where the story begins. A truck had to obviously deliver something as large as that. And the truck got stuck. There in the distance is the truck. As you can see, the truck ran off the road, nearly tipped over, went down the gully. So here's the gully that it could have gone down. As you can see, we've tied it, secured it with a piece of dental floss, which will surely hold should the truck trip over. There's also this tree which is sort of holding it on. Let's look down the side, shall we? There we go. There's the truck. That's my brother Paul laughing in the background. Here's the dental floss that's holding the truck up, sort of. Let's see. Wheels off the ground on one side. And this is all because my brother wanted a table. Put so many people out. Look at that. Almost ready to fall down the ravine. Bum, 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 bum. So this is only half the drama, because there's a truck coming that's going to try to pull us out. That'll be a lot of fun. And we'll be there, ladies and gentlemen, we'll be there. There's great forces are brought to bear on this stuck truck that Mark made. There you go, look. Milliseconds away from doom. It stopped. The driver, who's a large husky Maori guy, let out a girlish squeal. And as you can see, the door's still open from where he leapt, pirouetted and landed on the ground. As the sun sets on another day in paradise, we look at a debacle that only Mark Ewan could be responsible for. So now we've got another big truck to pull the truck that Mark got stuck in the rut because of a table. Mark stuck truck. The bat truck. Closer and closer they get. There's a lesson for us all. As you can see, they're going to employ the Pal Finger. An ominous sounding named piece of machinery. This is the man responsible. Without whom this situation would never have happened. Mark stuck truck. <laughs> As you can see, Mark is Mark is basically marinating in stress over this. <laughs> Holds himself directly responsible for this yeah, sure, you guys calamity. Have you guys paid for your tickets? <laughs> I can't remember you guys paying for your tickets. There you go. And there's the solution. Here it is. The deep ruts of despair caused by this stuck truck of mine. 
As Mark leaves the scene of the crime, the two trucks, rescue truck, finger pal, and Mark's stuck truck peel off and with the last falling branch leave the property. There you go. What an adventure.